What I like about working with Habitat for Humanity is it's all about building community. One of my favorite things about working here is definitely the work environment. Why do I love working here? Because they're really nice people to work with. They're fun and there's something new coming in every day. Well, a, 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 lot, of, a lot of the people that I work with, I get to know they're, all, they're also become friends. My name is John Tuglid. Uh, I'm very proud to say that I'm the one that brought the Habitat for Humanity to the value, Valley and also to Campbell River. Uh, my name is Kayla Tinga. I'm the general manager here at the Habitat for Humanity Courtney Resort. My name's Linda Greenwood. I've been with Habitat for Humanity as a volunteer for about four years. There's something new coming in every day. It's always interesting. A favorite item of mine has to probably be some of the stuff we have up front. We had some really nice jewelry from a corporate shipment and I really liked that. It was just really aesthetic and it sold pretty fast. One of the things that I, that I like is I, I like looking for, for tools. And so, so I'm looking, I'm looking for, so if I need a, need a new lawnmower, I will get, I'll, 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 I like, like, like a lawnmowers. I'm Kevin, I'm a regular customer here at the V-Store. When I look around me, there's all kinds of uh, still perfectly usable stuff here. Yeah. And it, it cuts down on waste and it's, it's just, there's, there's nothing bad about it. Everything is good, all good. Towels are donated, sometimes they have stains on them. I cut the good parts off make these swifter covers. Sometimes we get um, pillows, I take the covers off. The fillings are very expensive to buy new, but they're usually clean inside, so it still has good covers, so we repurpose that. And the restores are a very important part of our program because what that does is it creates, uh, people give, give uh, different things to Habitat. As you notice, this place is full of things right now and people come in and buy these things and the monies that they give, pay Habitat helps buy houses as well. Well, you know, if, if you have it and you don't need it, you know, donate it because that gets things out of your space and helps to declutter your life. And then it also helps people who get a chance to buy that as well as it helps to build um, homes for people. So it's a win-win-win situation. You get rid of something you weren't needing, somebody else gets to use it and then and then someone else gets a home built out of it. So it's a win-win-win situation. You just can't beat that. In the valley, I've seen Habitat build a lot of homes for a lot of low-income families. A lot of people that, with the unfortunate rising in prices of the housing market who can't afford houses on their own, Habitat swoops in and helps them. And it's really uh, uh, change, ch changes the world in many ways, you know, in a small way. But, you know, you have to go one step at a time. And that's what Habitat is doing. They're doing one step at a time, one family at a time, one, 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 ch one child at a time. And it's just happening you know, every day. I liken uh, Habitat to like a little acorn. You take a little acorn and you plant it and it grows up to be a great big oak tree. Everybody deserves a safe and affordable place to live. It, it's so important for a strong and happy life.